Hello fellow educators, this is Chemical Kim, and I want to share with you a, a bit of software that I put onto my computer that makes my video recording a little bit better uh, for online learning. It's a free piece of software, it's called OB, OBS, Open Broadcast Software, and what's really nice about it is it allows me to put a couple of things into my videos. Um, what you're seeing first here is the projection from my iPad. And um, I project my iPad onto OBS using software called Air Server, which is what I use in the classroom so that I can be wireless with the iPad in the classroom. It's really nice because I like to show visuals with chemistry and the iPad obviously has a lot of them. Um, it allows me, as you see with, with uh, seeing my face, it allows me to give that personal touch to my videos as well while I'm explaining lessons to the class. Um, if I'm wanting to work on problems with my students and I can uh, maybe open up one of my note-taking apps and we can just write and start working together on a particular problem and again I can as you see, I just wanted to go back to that actually. What I did also here is I split screen um, with the calculator so that, you know, of course, it's important to also, if you're doing some calculations in math and science, to let students see how numbers are actually put into the calculator. And I have this calculator app that looks like the TI 80, 84, 83 version. So it's kind of a nice little feature. And then um, what's also nice with the OBS is that I could add on another webcam if I wanted to, or I could simply turn my iPad here into another camera. And then if I did some demonstrations or I needed to show something um, visually on the desktop, I could do that with the uh, webcam on my iPad. So that's kind of a nice little feature. Or I could connect my phone and use that also as a, another camera. Um, and then it does even too, if I have some videos maybe in a lesson, I could add those videos into that particular lesson that I'm giving a little talk on on my video lesson. So I hope that you do find this to be a really helpful um, tool that you could utilize for making your videos. So.